I wake up most mornings with a passion to kick someone's head in. And it's no because I'm a pure mad raging walloper. It's just other people. They piss me off. I mean, I'm the kind of guy that if I had the money, I'd drive a fucking steamroller to work. And see when that wee learner driver's been sitting at the roundabout for an hour and a half. Do I go now? What about now? And not a single fucking car's went past. <coughs> Pancake. Sorry mate, roads are a dangerous place. Pulling up at traffic lights watching everyone shite themselves as they're scrambling to get out of the way. No such thing as traffic when you drive a steamroller. I'm not gonna lie, I just hate loads of things that people do. Like people who refer to hair gel as product. Product's a word used to describe drugs in American movies. Yo, what, uh, you wanna buy some product? What you try to say, like, I look like I've jumped heed first into a bag of cocaine. It's just blonde highlights. Go make yourself conscious. It's usually older folk that say that kind of stuff. Excuse me, son, why do you use product in your hair? Well, you're just jealous because you're old and you don't have any hair to use product in. Unless you take into account that that toupee you're rocking has been legally declared a weapon, which technically makes that a product. Which then begs the question, why are you using product in your hair? Hmm? And I'm, and I'm not just a grumpy old man before you ask. I'm not even old. I'll never be old. And even if I live long enough to ever be considered old, I'm still gonna deny it. But if I ever get to the stage where I start using the phrase back in the day, just shoot me. Just end it all. Put me out my misery. I remember back in the day. Do you know what else really pisses me off? People that work in shops that have got less customer service skills than a fucking Ryanair steward. I honestly think you could approach a steward on any Ryanair flight and be like, uh, excuse me stewardess, that, that, that woman's hair's on fire. And she would be like, what do you want me to do about it? Do I look like the fire brigade? Actually, I could light my cigarette off that. Even if you went up and told her there was a gaping hole in the side of the plane that sucked out half the passengers, she'd still stand there like... <sighs> People who work in shops at the tills though, really fucking annoy me. I mean, they literally sit there all day and they've got one job. To take my fucking money. But no! Half the time they just sit there gabbing to their workmate about being out in the shag the night before. You're just standing there awkward as fuck, trying to buy a pint of milk. Sitting there looking for one lassie to the other, hoping they're gonna spot you so you can pay for your semi-skimmed. You never want to just cut into the conversation, cause they look at you like you've just shat in their cornflakes and asked them to eat it. So you're just stuck sitting there waiting for them to finish talking. I actually came up with a solution for this situation. What I do is I just jump right into the conversation. Oh yeah, you were out with Claire, were you? Oh yeah, I was talking to her the other day actually. She was telling me what she really hates more than anything else. It's cunts that just stand at the till and talk when she's trying to buy a pint of milk. Or you could just whip out your cock and put it on the counter. They won't be long in spotting that. I mean, you'll probably get a wee bit of a criminal record and you might have to sign on a register for the next wee while. But you'll get your fucking milk. Alright, so this is the part of the video where I fire in a quick wee shameless plug. If you enjoy the shit that I'm talking, why not go over to my Twitter and check out in written form, at BatchyHD. I'll legit pay you back in spoonfuls of sugar whenever you're having a coffee. I'm just gonna leave that wee plug there. Where was I? Why? Things that annoy me. Like people who can't fucking park. It's so fucking annoying! So you're able to drive a car at 70 mile an hour down the motorway, with the windy down, the tunes blaring and smoking fags like a chimney and still successfully avoid cars travelling at the same speed. But you can't roll into a space at 5 miles per hour next to a totally stationary vehicle. I mean, it's hardly quantum physics. I mean, I'm not asking you to land a helicopter on a car moving at 50 miles an hour whilst being shot at by an army of mercenaries with AK-47s with a 5-star fucking wanted level, now am I? Also, don't park in my space or you'll come back to find an empty shell up on bricks. You'll find some wee Ned halfway up the street trying to sell you back your CD player. Or even if I had my steamroller. Also, I hate the tax man. He's a ball bag in every sense of the word. Sitting there taking chunks of my wages to give to the government who spunk it on absolute bollocks. Like porn or moats around their house. It reminds me of the financial scandal at Rangers a couple of years back. When some cunt charged a £60 face painting bill to the petty cash. I mean, I've seen folk take the piss, but come on. MPs are the creme de la creme. And I can assure you that if there was an award for ball bag of the year, it would be an MP that was going to win it. So allow me to summarise this video for you. I hate loads of things. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a wee like rating to let me know if I should bother my arse to make more in the future. And also subscribe for some reason. 
I forget. Just do it. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you all in the next video.